You want to create a realistic fire and blender? Add a sphere and press F3. Type Quick Smoke and select it. Scale the domain and select the sphere. In the settings, change the flow type to Fire and change the fuel to 2. Under Flow Source, change the surface emission to 1. This will make sure the fire starts closer to the object. Activate Texture and go to the Texture Settings. Add a new one and change the type to Clouds. Make them smaller, so 0.1 and up the contrast to 5. In the Sphere Settings, now select the created texture. Moving on to the Domain. Activate Adaptive Domain to increase simulation speed. Under Fire, you can change the reaction speed to 0.5. The lower the number, the higher the flame will rise. Also change Vorticity to 0.1. A higher number here results in a more noisy fire. At the top, we can now change the resolution. The higher the number, the more detailed the fire will be, but it will also take longer to bake the simulation. If you are happy, go to the cache, change the frames. Change the type to All and press Bake. If it's done, go to the Shadings tab and change the render to Cycles. Add an Attribute node and type in Heat. Add a Color Ramp node and connect it to Emission Strength. Move the black to the right and the white a little closer to left. Add in a third color and put it at the end and make it quite dark. Turn density to zero. Add a second color ramp and connect it to emission color. Change the color until you like the look. You can now add a math node in between and change it to multiply. This will brighten the flame.